One of the things that's useful to know is how fast your trees are growing or even how old they are. And one of the ways that we commonly use or a tool that foresters commonly use to, to give us that information is an increment bore. And I've got one here. I'll pull it out, I'm gonna put it together and we're gonna take an increment core out of this tree and show you how that works. This increment core is hollow. It's got, uh, got um, a little spiral here on the, like an auger bit on the end of it. And uh, we're gonna put it into the handle right here. And what we're gonna do with this is actually turn this uh, increment bore into this tree and extract a core, a wooden core out of it. And in that wooden core, we'll be able to see the growth rings. In this case, it's an oak, so they'll be really easy to see. And we'll be able to count them, see how wide apart they are, and give us an indication of growth. So I'm gonna set this up in the tree and I'm gonna <clears throat> try to hit the pith with it, point it straight towards the middle of the tree and try to hold it level. Press on it really hard, and once it gets engaged, we just turn it into the tree. Now, when we think we've gotten to the pith, we've got our borer far enough in to get all the way to the middle. We'll take the extractor that came out of the thing when I took it apart, and we'll put it in the increment bore like this. It goes all the way in. We'll back it out a turn and we'll pull the extractor out and that extractor on top of it is the increment core or a wooden core taken out of the tree hopefully all the way to the center and uh, from this core we can determine we can count the rings in it and determine the age of the tree um, and then we can also see how fast it was growing uh, we can count the rings back for example if i want to know how much in diameter this tree had grown over the last 10 years I can count the, the growth rings back, 10 years back, measure that, and then multiply it by two, and that'd be the diameter growth that we've gotten from this tree in the last 10 years. So these increment cores are very useful uh, for all of us to be able to know the age of the tree, tell the age of the tree, as well as how fast it's growing. Now I'll say one thing about this real quick. What we've done here is put a hole in the tree, <laughs> which is not a good idea if, if your objective is timber growth and you've got a really nice tree in your woods that has a lot of timber value, uh, would not suggest you take an increment bore and put a hole in it. Um, that's gonna degrade it uh, in some cases quite a bit. So typically we will bore trees in our stands or in our woods that maybe have an inferior quality uh, to them, they, they're not well formed, they have crook or sweep or something like that. So their timber value is not very high and, and w that way we have the ability to still get the age of the trees in that stand and still get information on growth without hurting our timber value. Mm -hmm.